Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Maximus the Fourth. What I have to present to you guys today is the brand new Pepsi Pineapple from Little Caesars exclusive. So, here's the story. From what I know, Pepsi just recently partnered with Little Caesars to come out with their own Pepsi Pineapple flavor. This is available nationally at Little Caesars only, and it is a limited edition flavor, so get it while you can. To my understanding, it made its launch on Monday of yesterday. So, just to give you a little bit of a backstory on this, as much as I can, from what I know personally, is that back in 2019, there were several sodas that were released. There was Pepsi Mango, Pepsi Lime, um, Pepsi Berry, and Pepsi Pineapple. Now, I heard a rumor that Pepsi Pineapple was first released in 2020 in very small limited portions for consumers to be able to try it and as well as Pepsi Mango to figure out what which one was going to become the winner. But I don't know if that's 100% true because I never saw any Pepsi Pineapple myself on any store shelves here in the U.S. What I can tell you is that I know for sure that in 2020 Pepsi Pineapple was available in Japan. Same with Pepsi Lime and Pepsi Berry. Those two were also available in Japan. And so the word goes around that the ingredients from the Pepsi Pineapple that's in Japan as opposed to the Pepsi Pineapple here in the States, which is at Little Caesars only, might be different, but the tastes could be similar. So I think that the thing to do would be to get a Pepsi Pineapple from Japan and one of these Pepsi Pineapples from Little Caesars here in the States and do a taste test side by side. But that's a video for another time. So here we are. In 2023, I am going to read to you guys a little bit of what some of these articles said, so bear with me. Starting first with the Pepsi Pineapple exclusively. It reads, Pepsi unveils exclusive pineapple flavor at Little Caesars. Together with Pepsi, we're satisfying all pineapple lovers regardless of how they feel about it as a pizza topping, said Greg Hamilton, Chief Marketing Officer. Starting July 17th, and for a limited time only, Little Caesars customers can get the pineapple pair-up combo, which includes a 16-ounce Pepsi pineapple and a large two-topping thin crust pizza when purchased online for $9.99. There's always a passionate discussion surrounding pineapple on pizza, quote-unquote, said Greg Hamilton. Together with Pepsi, we're satisfying all pineapple flavors regardless of how they feel about its pizza topping. The pineapple pair-up combo gives us our customers an exclusive opportunity to enjoy the tropical taste on their thin crust pizza and their Pepsi or both. What else do we got here? That wasn't very good. Let's read the Pepsi Pineapple Soda Lovers Wikipedia. Now, Pepsi Pineapple is a pineapple flavored colas released in July 2020, which is close to what I said, 2019 or 2020. It is pineapple flavored cola. The drink was released in eight can packs. The cans, it is sold and are tall and skinny, unlike standard cans of soda. The drink is similar to Pepsi Lime, Pepsi Berry, and Pepsi Mango that were released summer of 2019 in cans. Although Lime was available from Fountain Machines since 2012, Pepsi Pineapple is a yellow and blue can that says Pepsi with a splash of pineapple. It will most likely be discontinued in cans at the end of summer as lime, mango, and berry were at the end of summer 2019, even though lot or even though mango is now a permanent flavor of Pepsi. The drink is currently available online 
and at Walmart and other select country grocery stores, excuse me, a J Japanese Pepsi pineapple called Pepsi Japan Cola Pineapple was released, but the ingredients differ, but the taste might be the same. So, yeah, again, I'm going to have to challenge this because I don't think I ever saw Pepsi Pineapple in the States. But that's what the original release can looks like right here. If you can see that. I never saw this in the States, so I think that that can in particular from 2020 was available in countries like Japan. So that's all I have to share with you guys as far as the review goes on this soda. There's too many questions that need to be answered, and I don't have all the answers just yet. But what I am going to do right now, next, is I'm going to open up this bad boy, give you guys a rating on a scale of 1 through 10, let you know exactly what I think about it, and then that will be it. So here we go. Look over this can. As far as the nutrition label, it reads 200 calories, 55 grams of carbohydrates, 55 grams of sugar, zero protein, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is pretty much all you need to know. So now, without further ado, let's crack open this bad boy and see what we are dealing with. Wow, I can immediately smell the pineapple. That is very, very potent and distinct. There we go, that should be enough. <coughs> Smells very good. You can definitely smell the pineapple and the Pepsi. How does this taste? Okay. Not bad. You can definitely taste the pineapple, but the Pepsi is definitely dominating. But the pineapple still has a very distinct flavor. It's not just drowning. The pineapple is not drowning out the original Pepsi flavor like the strawberries and cream did in the Dr. Pepper flavor. This is actually a pretty decent balance. I would say that the Pepsi is a little bit more powerful than the pineapple. But all in all, I think that they did a pretty fair job with how they fused this together and put together the ingredients for consumers. Let me try just a little bit more. Yeah, see, that is very fair. If you're wanting to try something to where you can definitely taste a certain flavor that you're supposed to taste this is not bad not bad at all but what are we going to give this as far as a rating on a scale of one through ten hmm let me try this out of the can now So as far as what I'm tasting, you can taste the pineapple, yes, and you can taste the Pepsi, yes, but it's just not super incredibly delicious. I mean, it's drinkable, but as you guys know me to be, I'm the stingy reviewer here, so I'm going to be blunt when being blunt is needed, and that's the way I'm always going to be no matter what. Because 
The flavor of the pineapple in both the Pepsi are relatively mild. I'm going to give this a 6 out of 10. A very fair 6 out of 10. It's definitely a must try for any Pepsi fan and for all Pepsi consumers. And it is a limited time release. So make sure you get it while you can. It will not be on the shelves for a long time. But... I don't know when they're going to do away with this. I'm guessing maybe by the end of the summer. I don't know. That's a theory. But 6 out of 10 is all I'm going to give this. Nothing more. And I would like to see what some other people would think about this personally that might try this. So if you want to let me know what you think about it, you know what to do. All right, you guys, Pepsi Pineapple, that's it. Thank you for watching. Six out of ten. Maximus the Fourth here, Brandon Goodwin, signing out.